Here we go. Howdy, YouTube. This is Dungeon Bowl. This is gonna be weird. Now we're gonna play it. And I'm gonna explain how shit works. Hopefully. In some way. Uh, so we're gonna make a team. So that I can then challenge IB. And Dungeon Bowl has different teams. Because in Dungeon Bowl, if you've read the books, you know that Dungeon Bowl is one of the four major Blood Bowl tournaments. And rather than playing uh, races, you, you, you get sponsored by one of the uh, you, you know, colleges of magic. Uh, these are all the colleges here. I think there's actually more than there are in the uh, in the canon version. Never mind. Uh, and they are a bit different. They usually you can have a full team of something, and then you can have six of something else and two of something else. Um, and playing. Uh, having having done a bot game and wanting to win over IB, I think yeah. I am. Huh. I know what I want, but I don't want to. I I don't think I should. I should tell you what team I'm building, so we uh, so we can just be try hard about it. Okay, I think I've got a pretty decent team. Okay. Sort of. No, not really. <laughs> That's, and I don't have enough money for rerolls. Who needs rerolls? Okay. I might need rerolls. Uh. Mm. Yeah, screw it. I'm just gonna just gonna play with this. Let's. Does Fan Factor even do anything? Uh, no. Then. That is good enough for me. Save. And I'll create that team, and boom, there we go. And now I'm friends. And now I'm. You. You don't seem to be on my friends. Well, you need to find me. I think. Uh, okay. Let's see. Let's get. Uh, let's get two rerolls. And an apothecary. <laughs> I can't believe you're getting rerolls and an apothecary. Yeah, I made the mistake. Are you made of money? I, yes, I made the mistake with my first team of not doing anything like that. Uh, uh, okay, uh, uh, let's go with a YOLO build. Um, another thing I've learned is that you uh, need. Uh, way more players than you think. Yes. Uh, I feel like I am not. Uh, I am not max. I'm. I'm not building this as well as I could have. I feel like I should get a reroll. Now. I don't need rerolls. You don't need rerolls. I don't need rerolls. They'll, they'll just hold me back. Yep. Oh, I'm gonna. There we go. I wish I had a second monitor so I could see the chat. Yeah, it it, it should be. It, uh, well, Ethan is having a food, and then he'll he'll be in, and he can he can monitor the chat for us. In the meantime, we'll just have to try and. Uh... Uh, make do. Oh, 3D view. Yeah, it, I mean, if you've seen any of my other Blood Bowl videos, I didn't go over most of this because I figure you kind of know what's going on. But the uh, it's interesting to see how the UI has changed. This is just Cyanide that's made this and published this. So they're us basically Oops. using all their own assets from Blood Bowl Chaos Edition. And most of the stuff is looking the same, but the UI is still horrible. I feel like it's a, like, it's a bit better than Blood Bowl Chaos Edition. But I'm not actually sure that's true, or if it's, I'm just going kind of like, oh, this is a bit different. Is this it French? What? What? Oh, I'm looking. Oh, okay. Nothing. Never mind. Okay. Uh, I be, I am going to challenge you to a game. Okay. Uh, I'll sit here and wait. With this thing. Oh, so the challenge screen is a bit nicer. Oh, uh, oh I can actually challenge you with... Uh... I can. Oh, and I have to pick. So I played bridge ball when I just did a test, and that's fucking horrible because it's just a three square uh, block. That does sound horrible. Let's let's go for this big one. Let's go for proper dungeon ball. 
I haven't seen a challenge thing pop up. No, I'm Can not I done with it yet. Oh. What? What? Yeah. Okay. That work? Holy shit, look at it. It works. Yep. Wow. Let's have a look at these star players because I've never got to see them. Can I click on it? Well, you're not going to have enough inducements to buy any of them. I know. I know, but let's see if they've got any on extra. Okay, so you are the... You are the Amber Wizards. Uh -huh. uh, what what, uh, what teams do they have? They have Skaven as the two. Uh, Orcs and... What's the other one? Dark Elves? No. Fuck. That's not good. <laughs> Considering the, uh, the Amethyst Wizards have Skaven as their first one. Goblins as their second one. And trolls as their third one. Except I couldn't have. Uh, I mean, no, not trolls. Minotaurs. Except I couldn't afford any minotaurs. So. Gotta run us there. Yeah. Oh dear. My plan is to just get to the ball, run in, and score. You know how much I hate rats. Oh. Oh, and you only have 11 players. Yeah. That is a rookie cause... mistake. But I have 11 good players. Dude, I, when I played the AI, I had 16 players. Uh, and for some reason, I I just challenged the first bot because there are AI bots that you, oh well, there are bots that you can challenge online, and it didn't re it didn't tell me the team value or at least I didn't see it. So I went in with a fresh team at team value one thousand, and the bot had a team of team value two thousand, which <laughs> meant I had two mummies uh, because I went with an undead mummy, um, undead dark elf team I think. Uh, so I had two mummies, and then I got two more star players just to pad the team, uh, and they all died to uh, what I like to call warp sickness. Well, that's you got nobody to blame but yourself there. Okay, I am just gonna look at this pan here. I'm gonna press this. This is actually this is, I mean, there's there's a map at the top, which is. Good, I guess, because this. Press O. Because this is Dungeon Ball. Uh, okay, can I not get the. I guess not. Okay, let's see. Who do we have? Yeah, I want him in. I will take my Storm Vermin too. Uh, you. I'll trade for that guy. Who do we have here? Another Gut Trainer. Lineman, 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 bombardier. I guess that's fine. Uh oh, no, these. Oh, okay, so that's. <laughs> I thought, I thought this dude, these guys here to my left, was my actual team, but no, these are just, these dudes are just watching. I can't even move until no, you I, play stuff. I yeah, think. I'm. Uh, there's a clock in the top left. Oh. That shows me setting up. Uh, and I'm escape. done with that now. Alright, so who got go. down here? Okay, so uh, I'm gonna explain a few things here because I've played this before. Uh, so these things here, these uh, swirly, well not swirly, but the round circles with a ball on them, they're teleporters. If you step with a player onto one of these, uh, you will be randomly teleported to one of the other teleporters on the map. However, you do this by rolling a d6, and if you roll a 6, your player is lost to the warp and disappears from the pitch forever and ever and won't be back until the next game. Also, if you warp onto a warp where some uh, another player is standing, that player will then warp. So you can turn you can make warp chains. And if a player is warped twice in a turn, they uh, they get injured basically. Um the ball is going to be in one of these boxes. Um and once the ball has been found, uh, one uh, who, the team that has it has to move it to the other player's end zone. And apparently, IB is starting. Going first. Yeah. Come on, get on the teleporter. You. I'm not going on the teleporter. You, baby. you go on the teleporter. I will. I'm gonna go on a teleporter. Oh, that reminds me. I should teleport somebody in. You should. Thanks. Yeah, so every turn, uh, you can teleport someone in, and they will appear randomly. Oh. 
that is a nice teleport considering it's uh <laughs> there's an actual chest there yeah so if if the um if the ball is in this chest here really close to ib he's pretty much won already because i can't get to him um well let's find out shall we Uh, let's stand here and explode, shall we? There we go! Yeah, so, like, like I, I may have mentioned, the chests... Five out of six chests are booby-trapped. Uh, meaning that if you, uh... If you run over to them, uh, and they explode, you suffer a turnover. So you, you want to open a chest at the end of your turn. So my plan here is to cheat with gutter runners. Uh, yes, pretty much. No, my my actually, I can't tell you what my plan is because you'd you'd listen in. Also, I should have been smart, and if I press up here, I can decide who I want to. Uh, who I have in the reserves and who I want to get get back in. And I'm gonna go for this guy. He's gonna warp to the dungeon. That is a really nice warp for him. I should probably look at where all, where the rest of the chests are. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Ah, uh, and I fucked it up already. I think. Yes, I did. Okay. No, I didn't. Okay, so I can... I can... <laughs> Stuff uh, that's good to know. You can still go with diagonally if it's blocked. Are you sure you want to stand next to that big hole? Yes. Because now I'm going to go uh, get this ball. Win the game. <laughs> oh, fuck! What? Oh, come on. Okay, okay. Uh, pass? Where the- okay, over there. That's good. Suck it! Can't believe you're cheating already. That's a- Oh, I should- I should have probably hold, held on to it. Because you probably should screen share to me. I will. <laughs> like, uh, right about now. Whoops. Uh, here we go. This is gonna be weird for YouTube, but we'll just have to. We'll just have to deal. Uh, share window. That one. There we go. Sorry, everyone. I can't, I can't believe you're trying to run to the ball. Yeah, weird that. Uh-huh. Uh, it, it's really hard to tell, like, how far away things are in this map. Yeah. Uh, this is the ugliest piece of shit map I've ever seen in my life. Well, uh, you, you didn't, <laughs> you didn't see the, the first one I played. Uh, but yeah, the... You can build your own maps, apparently. Uh, this is one of the official ones. And it's in a dungeon, so I guess it's dark, but it also means it's kind of hard to read. It's really dark, except for where it's really bright. Yep. Like, that's, it goes between the two extremes. If the ball falls in the lava, I think it just... Let's go for it. It's a throw-in. If a player falls in a, in a lava, well, well, eat shit. Let's fall over. Yep. Okay. Well, I guess I lost this one. Well, no, no, I be. Pretty much. I, we're all gonna... we're all losers here. <laughs> You're not alone. Okay. Well, uh, you get to come over here. Oh, um, wow. uh, let's see. Wow. Wow. Can he? No, he can't. No, there's a wall in the way. Nah, I don't know. Not real. Well, partly. 
I've seen wall layer stuff. Can you do the wall bouncing thing? Yes. Like the most fun? Good. Because that was like the only reason to even play it. But in this map doesn't really have many wall bouncing things. Yeah. This is probably... I remember like the standard map was like two corridors down each side mm -hmm. and then like a corridor to a big room to a corridor to a little room. And like that mirrored for the middle. Yeah, like uh, we should probably play, try and play one that's uh, a bit um, less cluttered and tighter, because this really like, uh, yes, no, that's fine by me. That's and you're not, not allowed the wizards in Dungeon Bowl. Nope, because it's. Uh, if I remember the canon correctly, the reason there's Dungeon Bowl is because otherwise the different uh, uh, magic colleges would just fight each other. So, yeah. and they didn't want to lose any of their good wizards. So they're like, you know what? Let's just sponsor a Blood Bowl team each, put them in a dungeon, and see what happens. So they did, and that. Why you can't use any wizards? Because yeah, you can't you can't use any wizards. Because how could you tell which wizard did it? Because everyone watching's a wizard. Mm -hmm. You can't. And then obviously for gameplay, it's because some areas are literally a three square wide corridor, and you will get firewalled and die. Yep. Uh, I think there was there there was a map you could play because I have to remember I have to take it to IB's end zone. Uh, so I totally ran... Well, I didn't run the wrong way. I still think I did the right thing. Uh, because he would have blocked me down otherwise. Um, hey, now. Uh, so I have to get it over here to hit uh, his side. So I guess it, it's not that bad if you find it, like, early on your own. Because you can try and get through. But, uh, most openings, like, this opening is two and four. Well, it's two here. So you could just put, like, your two big guys and be like, look at me. Wow. Gonna run to your own end zone? Maybe. Well, then. I'm eating a muffin. Wow. Are you gonna teleport? You're gonna teleport, you jerk. No, I'm just eating a muffin. Okay, then. I'm not going anywhere. Yes. That was stupid. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Now, um, do I throw it at your rats or do I throw it? Mm, I think I'll throw it back. Mag Magnetic North said, have they switched up the placement? Yes go. and no. And yes, they have. They've just made yes and no the other way around. Yeah, that was, <laughs> that was so stupid. <laughs> I shouldn't have done that first. I'm really bad at bombardiers. Well, as in, I rarely play with the bombardiers. I'm like, uh. I do not want to use my apothecary. I also forgot to warp someone in, which was equally stupid. Oh, thanks for reminding me. Mhm. Mm ah, oh. you should you should uh, you should pick up one of these. Uh, you should open one of these boxes. There's probably something cool in them. Probably, probably. Definitely, nothing bad has ever come out of a box. Nope. These are good ass boxes. Here's another, another cool thing. So I've got I've got like player names on, or like positionals, but the players that I've warped in since I I activated it don't have nope. them. Oh, there we go! Look at all these dudes. You know what though? Uh oh. Nearly. Yeah. Um, Eki Thump um, says, isn't KO pretty much the same as Badly Hurt if there's only one drive? Uh, well, you can get them, uh, I can, rather than warp someone in, I can magic sponge them and they come back, uh, the next, uh, turn, you can, you so. Can, yeah, as long as they're only yeah. KO'd. I should not have both of these dudes here. In fact, I should not have any of these dudes here. But there you go. And stand this guy up. 
And then... Please, Moobot. What the fuck am I going to do? Moobot, please. Why not more Dungeon Bowl? Moobot, are you seeing this shit? <laughs> <coughs> Crazy Blue Flame says Magic Sponge sounds shady as hell. Magic Sponge is what they use in real football or soccer for the unwashed masses. Everyone knows when a, when a man falls down, they use a Magic Sponge and you're better and you can get up. Yeah. It's really good. Well, I'm gonna end my turn. Wow. That was amazing. Yeah, it's a pretty sick play by me. I reckon. It's not like you're gonna be able to score. Probably not. The UI is cleaner in many ways. Actually, you you yeah, and it doesn't have yeah. the huge scoreboard on Actually, the Actually, you are able to score if you if you make a pass if you make a pickup and a pass and a catch and two yeah, JMIs. Yeah, I'm having real bad time with this uh, this blocks here. Oh, no, not the whatever that is. Have a hole. Whomp. Whomp. All right. On the one hand, sign I did give you this for free. On the other hand, it sucks. <laughs> like, to be to be fair, though, like, it's more the fact that Dungeon Ball itself yeah, is a oh, shitty yeah. fucking premise. De definitely, definitely. This is uh, this is not particularly on Cyanide. This is more, well, someone has a spare, like... And it's not, like, the thing, works. too, it's not supposed to be, uh, like, it, it was even created more like a, for, for a laugh. So yeah, it was meant to be. You want to do like five minutes of blood bowl do in a dungeon, and you didn't because you didn't bring your big blood bowl board. Mm -hmm. And also, it's based on uh, like the second edition rules. I think that's yeah. when they made this, yeah. which yeah. are pretty different. Mm -hmm. Let's, let's mm -hmm. see. Um, let's yeah, see the pass. This is, this is <gasps> definitely not on Cyanide. You made it. Anyone from Cyanide watching? It's not your fault. Well, it's they made the game still, so I guess. Like, are you gonna do the two GFIs? Um, deciding. They tried their what, best. What, what's even stopping you? The fact that I could fall over and you could grab the ball. Yeah. Although I could win, so let's do it. Yeah, I like I. I there is no downside to this. Oh, he, <laughs> his touchdown animation—it's a backflip. So I'm like, oh, he's falling down. No, he just flipped around. Wow, what a game. <sighs> hey, I have three achievements. Oh, right, it's called Warhammer Quest. There you go. Okay, who got the MVP? Okay. Uh, escaping, dude. This is also like, what's even the point of how do you level these guys up? Because you, you, you only get one touchdown a game. Um, I guess you gotta be bashy. Very slowly. Yeah. Lots and lots of MVPs. Okay, well that's a quick game, so I'm gonna stop this for the YouTube's. Bye, YouTube. <laughs>